Team Exercise 46 – The Drawing In this exercise the team sits at a long table with a big white paper or a canvas that is suitable for making a drawing or a painting. Ask the participants what subject or theme has been most relevant recently. This team agrees that they could use more positivity in their communication and pick it as their theme for the exercise. For each participant, three evenly white lines will be drawn vertically on the paper. This makes three empty strips for each person. Everyone sitting in front of the paper now draws something which he associates with positivity in the first empty strip. This can be something figurative or something abstract. Everyone moves one seat to the right. The person sitting on the far right now moves to the far left. Now everyone sits behind two new strips that he can draw on. The participant draws something in the second strip that connects to the drawing in the first strip made by the previous person. An abstract image doesn't have to stay abstract. As the drawings come to an end, the participants move one seat to the right and make their last drawing in the third strip. Encourage the group to use their imagination and tell them that there are no incorrect drawings. The team can draw anything that comes up in their mind. For one more time the participants move a seat to the right and finish the drawing by connecting the strips. Logically, one participant will not be drawing this round. When the drawing is complete, everyone will write their names in the left remaining strip on the paper. Now you ask the team what they personally see in the complete picture and how it relates to the theme positivity for them. Their interpretation will be written down on the right strip. One participant shares that he thinks the various colors represent the different types of personalities in the team, who can all learn from each other. Someone else adds that he likes the various natural elements in the drawing, just like the natural way in which the team communicates. Let everyone share and explain their thoughts. The drawing can be put up for display in their workplace, as a reminder to keep communicating and interacting in a positive manner. And of course, it's just very fun to look at. The trainer guides the team and applies variations to the exercise. What kind of variations you can read below this video on YouTube. And haven't you subscribed yet? Click on the subscribe button to stay tuned for a new video each Sunday on youtube.com slash team exercises to improve cooperation and communication.